Hi everyone, Antoinette here. Today, I'm gonna to talk about the differences of how to know if someone is confident, cocky, or arrogant. Why is it important? Because so often we use these terms interchangeably. However, not only is there a difference between the three, but sometimes they're actually opposite from each other. I love this quote by Agam Shah, who says, there's a fine line between confidence and arrogance, and it's humility. Confidence smiles and arrogance smirks. Now keep in mind, when I talk about the confident person versus the cocky person versus the arrogant person, it's possible to change. And that's another reason why it's really important to understand the differences whenever we think we may be on the verge of being cocky or we think we may be on the verge of being arrogant in a certain situation. First of all, a confident person believes in themselves. They believe in their abilities. They believe in their ability to get things done. Even if it's something that they haven't done before, they have confidence in the situation. A cocky person, on the other hand, is overly confident in themselves, so much to where it's actually annoying to others because they think so highly of themselves. Their ability to do something may be here, but they are acting cocky whenever they're overly confident in their ability and their attitude is way up here. And then there's the arrogant person. The arrogant person is always comparing themselves to other people and they are always the one that is better. Everybody else is beneath them. Nobody else knows as much as them. Nobody else can do things as well as them. They're always comparing themselves to others outwardly and everybody else comes out the loser. And what's ironic is arrogant people do this because they lack confidence. So they're not confident. They're not even cocky in that they're overly confident. They actually lack the confidence and that's the reason why they're acting with arrogance. So how do each of these three types of people treat you? And here's how to tell the difference. The confident person will always respect you and they'll show it and you will know that you're respected by them. The cocky person is always trying to impress you and the arrogant person disrespects you. And you and I know that when we feel disrespected, then that's a red flag. Now, how do you identify these types when they are wrong about something? When the confident person makes an error, they own up to it. They will admit where they made an error and they don't try to push the blame off on something else or someone else. They own up to it. And if they're cocky, they attribute the error to something outside of themselves, meaning they're not taking any responsibility for it. It's always due to an external factor that they had no control over. So there's never any ownership regarding their error. They're making excuses instead of valid reasons. And if you wanna know the difference between an excuse and a reason, check out my video above and in the description below. And if it's an arrogant person, they're never wrong. What about when you're communicating with them? The confident person speaks as if they're right and they listen as if they're wrong. In other words, they speak with confidence, they make their points, they'll tell you their opinions, they'll tell you their thoughts on something, but when it comes time for you to speak, and if it's a differing point of view, then they will listen and suspend their beliefs as if they are wrong so that they can hear you out. The cocky person doesn't really listen at all. They're just trying to convince you of how great they are and of all their abilities. When you're communicating with an arrogant person, they not only lack empathy, but you feel in the conversation like you are less than them. So here's a one word identifier that I came up with for each of these types. A confident person is kind. A cocky person is self-absorbed. And an arrogant person is narcissistic. Now, in looking back in past encounters, do you actually think, you know what? I actually was cocky in this situation or even, what's worse, arrogant in a situation. 
Self-awareness is the first step to moving forward and remembering it's always best to be confident rather than cocky or rather than arrogant. If you think this video will help someone else, I hope you'll share it and I hope you'll subscribe to my channel.